Hi, I'm Robert from Move Work Forward. In this section, we are going to cover webhook support for Jigit in GitHub and GitLab. Webhooks are fantastic because they can let Jigit know about new branches, commits, and pull requests moments after they happen. To begin, from Jira, go to the Managed Apps section and then to your Jigit plugin config. From here, go to Settings, then select General Settings, scroll down, and enable webhook support. The important thing to note here is the URL to use in your webhooks, which will be provided for you. It is your base Jira URL, slash plugins, slash servlet, slash jigit, slash webhook. Also want to include a webhook secret or password, which is then used to validate the payload signature. So we will start with GitHub. From your repository, go to your repository settings, select webhooks, and then add your webhook. So as you can see here, it is following the format. You want the content type to be application forward slash JSON. And then to select your individual events, you want to include at least branch or tag creation and deletion, pull requests, and pushes. However, as you can see, we've included a few extra and you can specify as you desire. Then you want to update your webhook and you are good to go. For GitLab, it is similar. You will go to your settings and webhooks, include your URL and your secret token. Then for this, you want to include your push events for all branches and merge request events. Again, you can add additional events should you wish. Save changes and you are good to go. And then webhooks will speed up the process for you when you're creating branches, pull requests, commits. You'd be able to see them almost instantaneously in your Jira project. Thanks.